is that? The Stable Diffusion Deform extension? In this tutorial we will walk through the Deform extension in Stable Diffusion from installing to making your first AI video chips from one image. By using Stable Diffusion rendered videos and image transitions you can instantly create stunning Stable Diffusion images and videos independently in Automatic 1111. Let's get started. This time I'm using my local install Stable Diffusion and Automatic 1111 web UI for the tutorial. First head over to extensions, click the available tab. You can search the Deforum extension by just typing Deforum in the search box. Once it appears, click the Install button on the right and it will start processing it. It will show a message installed into U Folder Path when the installation finish. Remember, always click the Apply and Restart UI when you install something new here. After Stable Diffusion, Automatic 1111 Restart, you will see a new tab on the top called Deforum. That's right, this is the fun part begin. Now, as you can see, it has sub-tab menu under this extension. Mostly, we're going to use functions in Run, Keyframes, Prompts, and INIT. For the Control Net and Hybrid video, we will talk about those in other video for Advanced Stable Diffusion video. So, I am always starting with the INIT tab. Here we tell Stable Diffusion which image we're going to use for the transition video begin with. You can put your local computer file path here, or even a web URL of an image. Now I check Use INIT, because I want to start the video with the image I'm setting here. The first video, I'm going to generate video of two military guys. And keyframes, you can set the output video in 2D or 3D style. Other options, to be honest. Play around with it based on your preferred style, it should be fine. Here the motion, I want to mention something. The three rotation settings works for 3D video mode. So try it yourself. Maybe zoom in the character is not your style. Then you can play around with other setting. Okay, let's wait for the video to generate. This take a while for the first time to run this. The Stable Diffusion Automatic 1111 are going to download some files on the first time it runs. So be patient. Then it will start processing your image to video. After the process goes to 100%, you can click the Open Folder icon button, and there you have it. I have tried out few images in this tutorial, and let's see the result. So I hope you like it. This is a basic setup and using Stable Diffusion Deforum extension. If you want to know more advanced usage of Deforum or other Stable Diffusion extensions, let me know in the comments section below. Until next time, see you in the next video.